Hi. In this video, we'll show how you can use Burp to help test for parameter-based access control. Some sites use insecure access controls based on request parameters. For example, a site might use a role ID parameter to denote whether the user should be treated as having admin privileges in the associated response. Even if these parameters don't enable you to bypass server-side access controls, they might still be able to get past some client-side controls. For example, they might reveal additional attack surface, such as an admin page that you can view but not necessarily interact with. You can test the effect that these parameters have by using Burp Suite's match and replace rules to swap out values and analyze the results. If you'd like to follow along, you can use the lab Use a role controlled by request parameter from our Web Security Academy. Before you start, you'll need to map the application's visible attack surface. We've already mapped out some of the lab here. Once you've done this, you can then go to the top level menu and choose Burp Search. You can use the search bar to look for any potentially insecure parameter values, such as false and read, and make a note of any values that return results. In this application, although searching for read did not find anything, searching for false does return results. So now go to the proxy tab and click proxy settings. We can configure a match and replace rule to change the details as requests pass through BERT proxy. To configure a new match and replace rule, click add. Select Request Header from the Type drop-down list. Enter one of the parameter values that returned results during the search into the Match field. So we'll add False. Now we can set the value that should be used as the replacement, in this case True. Click OK to save your rule. You can repeat these steps so the same replacement can be carried out in the Request Body and Request Param value and for any additional parameter values. Now you can remap the site. As you remap the site, look for signs that the attack surface has changed. For example, we can now see a link to the admin page. 